here's another video I didn't want to make, but it's another lofting style video. Neither of us wanted to make it because we don't like putting attention to people who don't deserve it, but his behavior is absolutely appalling. It's it's beyond appalling. In fact, it's really stepping some major boundaries, and because YouTube fails to act upon it, it's kind of left to the YouTubers. Yep. And I know a lot of YouTubers are, you know, speaking out events about against lofting styles, but it needs to happen more, sadly. Mm-hmm. His account needs to be taken down. His email needs to be blocked. Something needs to happen. And we're not just talking about lofting styles account. We're talking about the alts as well. Yeah, because he has a... L How many accounts does he have? We've confirmed, as of now, we've confirmed three other alts. All right, so we're looking at, what, four accounts? Yep. Total? Okay, that makes sense, because that's usually how many likes he gets. Yep. So, because I'm from New Orleans, and I believe in matters, you can go first and tell about your latest experience into your last rant video. All right, since my last rant video, which I'm very much considering taking out of private, the only reason I took it out of the public viewing was because I wouldn't want my possible employers to be looking through that when they go through my background check, which, thankfully enough, I got a job, so I'm very much considering putting it back up there for the time. And hooray for you. Yeah, thank you. It's going to be paying quite a bit, actually. It's only seasonal hiring, but I've already had other people offer me jobs <coughs> from November onwards, so I'm good. Anyways, since my last rant video, he was quiet for a bit, but then just came right back, just like he did the last time, just like he did the last three times. And when he came back this time, he was even worse. So, me and Rising Tide were talking to Verlis on his video about a few things. I can't remember which video in particular it was about. I think it might have been a review of the suspect test and banning on Mega Maywall or uh, Aegislash. It was either one of the two. And he then comments, replying to me, he's like, oh my god, you look so fuddly with your hair cut. So that pissed me off. And I think you look fabulous. I do too. And I've had a lot of people compliment me on my hair. So... I don't, I didn't really take it to heart. What I did take to heart was when I called him out on it, and he basically called out, he's like, your tits are so fucking ginormous, I want to motorboat them. And then, what, what did he call me? Did he call me a fugly slut or a whore or something? He called me something along those lines. So, so yeah, we have sexual harassment, everybody. Add that to the list. So, and I will be getting, I will be getting the screenshots from... Jenna slash Heather Souza. Tell me I said your name right this time. Yes, you did. I did it! But I will be getting screenshots, so I can actually prove that this is going on. I will leave a description to all the images from her files, from my files, so we aren't just making stuff up. We have evidence. Yep. So, keep going. After sexual harassment, then insulting you. Oh, and then it gets worse because he starts insulting Rising Tide and then using his alts to downvote his videos. So, I went and I asked a few friends, like, hey, and these were people who were in on uh, Lofting Styles shit, and I said, hey, this is my friend Rising Tide. He's having a little trouble lately with his likes and dislikes because Lofting Style decided to harass him. So why don't you go leave a few likes? So they boosted up his likes and shit. But afterwards, Lofting Style comments, he says, on one of uh, Rising Tide's philosophy videos, he's like, interesting but boring. Do I don't want this stupid shit. And he, <coughs> Rising Tide responds to that. He's like, those are two completely different things. And then banned him from the channel, which I was happy he did that because he's a fucking moron. Not... Yeah, Boston Styles, obviously. So, yeah. uh, afterwards, I decided to look through his comment history, which I can do. Anyone can do it. And I started seeing some horrible shit. Like, 
if any of you know Cuddle of Death, he's posted something gross, absolutely gross. He said, those saggy tits on the left screen, though. And she says, apparently you don't know what saggy tits look like. He says, so you're implying that you have no saggy titties? So that's why you have to mid and he, but like, I'm reading this exactly as he said it. So that's why you have to made an avatar with a girl showing her saggy titties. Ha! Huh? And then she says, I'm implying that the titties of my avatar are not saggy. And you calling them t saggy, that means you have, have not seen saggy titties. Or you haven't seen enough titties to realize they aren't saggy. The titties that are on my avatar have are perfect natured titties. I feel awkward reading this. But, oh my god, he's just an asshole. And what's next? Calling out other people for using no copyright sounds just because Verlis started using it recently. And he called someone a cocksucker. And what else did he do? He started harassing Plasma Ru uh, Luxray like nobody's business. And Broken Wolf, or Becky, again. And I love Broken Wolf. Lots of hugs for her. She is a great person, really. She is absolutely amazing. But he's he's said Troy and saying, you like your own videos? But then Plasma Luxray again coming in with the save, saying that so do you, which he does, with four other alts. Are you fucking stupid? Are you really that fucking stupid? And then harassing Moody Pones because she had a zit on her lip and accused her of dick-sucking... Uh, what else? There is, oh, there's so many. I'm going through screenshots right now. That's what I have pulled up. Hey, I'm willing to break this off into separate parts if you want, because, I mean, the more we get on this guy, maybe YouTube will eventually listen. Yeah, hopefully. Oh, oh, this is, this was in one that I probably didn't mention in my last video, but he tried to call out Shady Penguin for taking screenshots of the opponent's team during battling. He says, that's considered cheating, you know. Are you fucking kidding me? No, it's not. If VGC rules allow you to have pen and paper to write down the opponent's team, it's not cheating. It's not. It's never considered cheating. This has been a practice since competitive battling was a thing. You fucking moron. Oh my god. Just... And then he tries to insult Plasma Luxray again. He's like, you call my video shitty and then to fix the lagging. And then he calls someone a more he calls someone retarded and a bitch. Uh, oh, and I have screenshots of one of his alts liking all his videos. And that's almost all he would like except for shitty WWE wrestling. Let me tell you something, Lofting. I'm going to break your dreams. WWE is fake-ass wrestling. It is. You know what WWE is for? Gay-ass men who wrestle on the floor for money, and they're basically hookers. That's what it's for, bro. Eat it. Come get it. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be ruthless in this video. I don't care if I come off as a bitch. He's an asshole. He deserves to go down. Just No, I let it go. Oh. Let it all out. Oh, I know. And then, then, like, the logic is, like, I already have a sock for myself, so why would I have to breed a uh, primate? Sock and primate are two completely different Pokemon with two completely different play styles. You dumbass motherfucker. Okay, just because I have a Charizard X doesn't mean I, like, oh, it means that Charizard Y is still a possible thing for me to breed and use. You know why? Because they're two completely different fucking Pokemon! It's called Variety! Bruh. Oh, and then he starts insulting someone else, saying, like, you are, you're a girl and you have a beard, or to telling Maryland to go on Weight Watchers. You know who Maryland is, right? I've gone to the site, but sadly, no. Maryland is a big name, okay? He wants to say he has a big name, air quotation marks. No, nobody knows who you fucking are except for all your petty art theft and constant raging at people just because people downvote your shitty videos and your shitty play style. That's the only way people know you, you dumbass. Maryland, on the other hand, 
is a seasoned battler. He has run his own site, and he just he's an amazing person. If you guys aren't subbed to Maryland, go sub to Maryland. I still watch his videos frequently, but I keep forgetting to press that sub button, so I'm going to do that after the video. But then, oh, who is this? This is, um, what's his face? Not Plasma X-Ray, but Samurott Leader. He says, I'm really surprised you reached 50 subs. And he's saying it in a really condescending way. And then, oh, he's, tell, he's going on to someone else's video and saying, you're a million times better than Verlicify. Or the time he was being racist and he's like, oh, well, I said no racism intended, so that means it's not racist. How many times do we have to fucking explain this to you, kid? Just because you say it's not racist doesn't mean it's not racist. It's still racist. In fact, if you have to say no racism intended, that just makes it worse. Because you know full well that you shouldn't say it, but you say it anyway, and you have to try and justify it with that lackluster excuse. You dumbass motherfucker. You dumbass motherfucker. Seriously, that is the only woman you will ever be inside. It's your mother. And that is it, okay? I think he's a preemie because I think his mom had an epiphany. He's like, nope, not going to deal with this. I want him out now. Oh, I wouldn't doubt it. <laughs> if you ask me, she should have left him at the hospital. Oh, and then he calls R4 a shitty battler. He calls, oh, he tells uh, someone to go suck his dick. Uh, then he's trying to say that he knows how to calculate, but he doesn't. And then someone calls him out on it. And then he's try like, the person was trying to help him and be polite about it. But no, no, he just, he just gets pissed off at them. And then Moody Pone's ex-boyfriend was filming a video and he calls him a drunk ass and saying, no wonder Moody broke up with you. Okay, you don't fucking say that to someone. Ever. If someone is just going through a breakup, or you know what, just anyone ever, if they went through a breakup, even if no matter how long ago it was, you don't say that shit. You know what? How about I say this? Oh, I'm looking at your videos. The shitty quality with you shaking your camera constantly or running the TV in the background. Really? You did that in the last video. You know how fucking distracting that was? I couldn't... Oh, no, I just had... Kyle over I cared more about what was on the, the TV. Video. I, yeah, so did I. I wanted to know what show that was. But you know what? I couldn't stand listening to his annoying fucking ass voice to care. I couldn't tolerate it. And then he called... Oh, hmm? Oh, no, no, keep going. Oh, what what else? He calls Tyranitar Tube annoying for his voice. Um, okay, that was the one with Rising Tide. That's Rising Tide. Oh, then he insults someone's video. He's like, what the fuck is this shit? And he's like, they suck donkey balls. Really? Really? Okay, wow. More harassing of Plasma Lux Ray, downvoting all his videos. And then he tries to say that one of his alts is his sister because Plasma Luxray called him out on it. He's like, stop downloading me with all your calls. Like, That's my sister. That's my sister. No, it's not because you came and confronted me with that all before saying that it was you. So pick up one. Is it you or is it your dumbass sister? And actually, no, I take that back. Your sister's probably nice, but she's got a dumbass brother like you. Ugh, I feel sorry for her. I pity your sister. If she exists. If she, yeah, if she exists. Because I honestly don't see your parents wanting to squeeze out another one if you were the first one. If, you know, seeing how they raised you, they probably think they fucked up so much of a parent they'd never want to have children again. Hmm. Oh, and then someone calls him out for stealing just a bombs, and who, who's the other guy? If they didn't list the other guy, but just a bomb's vector and using it as their own. And, you know, and this is actually where you called him out for saying that, uh, for being homophobic and a bastard, okay? Just get the fuck off. Nobody likes you. You can pretend all you want that people like you, but you have 
people pissing on you every goddamn day, and they are doing it because it's the right goddamn thing. And that ends my side of the rant. Go.